Hello creative people, welcome back to another brand new photoshop tutorial by Mr. Rabbi. In this video, I am going to show you the best way of editing wedding photography. So guys, we have a great tutorial for today, so let's get started and have some fun. First of all, open your image inside of Adobe Photoshop. Now remove the spots from the face of the subject. Select the spot healing brush tool. Now click on the spots to remove them from the face. Go to filter, nick collection and color effects pro 4. I am using dynamic skin softener to make the face of the subject smooth. Simply pick the color from the face, then adjust the value. Now go to filter, noise and reduce noise. Create a new layer and press Ctrl Shift Alter E to take a snapshot of your layers. Now go to filter, blur gallery until shift Now duplicate the layer by pressing Ctrl plus J or you can right click on the layer and click on the duplicate layer. Now go to filter, blur gallery and tilt shift. Again duplicate the layer by pressing Ctrl plus J. Now go to filter, blur gallery and fill blur. Hold alter and click on the mask icon to create a negative mask. Now select the brush tool, decrease the hardness and the opacity then draw over the area you want to blur out. Now see the before and the after and you will see there are huge difference. Press Ctrl Shift Alter E to take another snapshot. Now drag some light overlay to improve the image look. I will give the link of the image in the description below, so feel free to use it. Press Ctrl plus T to transform the image.
Now change the blend mode into screen. Give some time to place the overlay on a perfect place so that it looks good. You can also decrease the opacity to make it more soft. Now take another snapshot by pressing Ctrl plus Shift plus Alt plus E. Now go to filter and camera raw filter. Play with the numbers as your choice to get a perfect color gradient. Then take another snapshot. Go to filter and lens correction. Then click on the custom icon. Now decrease the vignette. So guys our final editing is done, give more time to make the photo look professional. So guys hope you enjoyed the video, give a thumbs up to my video, also subscribe my channel for more videos. Thank you, see you next time, till then have some fun.